Hey everyone, Shabby Me here, and welcome back to another concept here on WE 2K19. Now, this one is our first tournament we're going to look at, and it's a tournament we have done a few years ago. It was the King of the Cruiserweights. Now, last time, it was a little bit more sort of refined because we utilised the people that were in the universe mode at that time. It was the guys from Octane and Adrenaline back at the time. And um, Whereas this time, I want to try and do it just using everybody we can. So the idea would be to get all the best cruiserweights we possibly can in a massive knockout tournament and just basically go all the way through and find out who the best cruiserweight is. And I'm talking not just the cruiserweights from this day and age and the people in the game, but utilizing some of the best around as well. So And the best in history. So look at people like Jushin Liger, Ultimo Dragon, Eddie Guerrero, Rey Mysterio, Dean Malenko, all those sort of guys and getting a few of the Mexican names in, Pentagon, Phoenix... King Cuerno, all those sort of guys. But the one question I want to ask you guys is, do you want to stick to the cruiserweights or do you want to just go for anybody under a certain weight? I mean, if we looked at it logically, there's 205 Live, potentially people like Finn Balor uh, and people like that would also be involved. And that's the interesting thing. I don't know what you guys want to do on that one. Would you rather stick to the people that were in their time, the actual cruiserweights, part of the cruiserweight division, or would you like to see those guys in there as well? I mean, we could use... I'm assuming people like Adam Cole would be under the weight limit, and um, people like Kyler Riley and Bobby Fish would be there as well. Of course, we've got Zack Sabre Jr. from the tournament as well. So there's a lot of fantastic names we could utilize in this tournament, and I'm really looking forward to it. I really want to do it again. Like I said, we did one before, and that was actually won by the man in the ring, Kalisto. He won the first ever King of the Cruiserweight tournament in our universe mode. But like I said, back then it wasn't as in-depth. We only used the people that were in the universe mode at that point in time. So there was some fantastic cruiserweights that didn't get a look in. This time, we're going to go bigger, we're going to go better, and we're going to go just major on. And I think the winner of the tournament should get some sort of reward. Of course, the winner of the tournament will be forever named on the blogger as the winner of this year's tournament. And But I think also maybe they'll get a shot at a cruiserweight championship in the next universe mode that starts up that has a belt, I think, would be a good shout as well. But yeah, let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Let me know who you think should be in the tournament. And again, let me know about if you think that people like Adam Cole, Kyle O'Reilly and them sort of people should be involved as well. I mean, weight rise, they do qualify, but it's all down to the style. So let me know what you want to see. Of course, as always, this is a voting system, really. Um, so what you need to do is you need to like the video, you need to view the video, you need to comment. And uh, the most combined interactions this video has, the more likely it will happen. I dare say this will happen at some point in 2K19. But yeah, I'm looking forward to doing this. It's really one of my favourite styles of wrestling, cruiserweight wrestling. So... To have a, a massive tournament showcase in the best would be absolutely fantastic for me. So let me know what you want to see. I've been Chevy Gamer. Thank you much for watching. And I'll see you very, very soon for our next episode in the concept rosters. Bye.